<laughs> it's like where are you from? I'm I live in the Bay. I I was like born and raised in the Bay Area, so. So you go to a lot of games. Oh, I go to a ton of Giants games. I didn't go to many last year because last year was the most I've actually like worked uh throughout the year. Like we were just super swamp. Uh, so I didn't get to go to many, but um, before that, I probably go to maybe like I'd say probably twenty games a year at least. That's that's a good bit. Mm-hmm. No, I mean when it, uh during our playoff run when I was just out of uh when I was just out of high school, like in twenty fourteen, I I was going to there was stretches where I would just go to like four games in a row. I was just spending so much money. But like yeah, uh, spending fifteen bucks on a hot dog. Oh, dude. Ooh. Okay, I I gotta give you. I gotta come at you with a little more respect, dude. I can't just feed you that down the middle. Nice <laughs> sure rib. Can, That's bro. Juan you Pierre can... too. Oh my god. Bro, you can feed me that any time of the day. I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, I gotta relax. I gotta relax. I mean, that's, here has definitely been my best card, dude. Well, that's a, I wouldn't say best card, but he gets on. Yeah, I mean, that's a free run. You just got him the second, and now it's like stuff would have to Yelly go severely bit. wrong. The not Yelich is, dude, he is the most sickening oh, card in the game. If it wasn't for his defense being so like, oh my lord, my man Josh Hader came to play today. I mean, oh, that's this just is our Yelich. first game, bro. Yeah, it's just Yelich. You haven't <laughs> even just... hit yet. <laughs> Dude. No, but honestly, Yelich, like, it, it's kind of like a running joke, like, on my channel, on Twitch. Jeez. These aren't cheapies either. I gotta get somebody warmed up. Casey Mize is looking foolish. But, um, it's kind of a running joke. Every time some... Because Yelich is on everybody's bench. You know what I mean? Because what? of his defense. Yeah, and, like, nobody... Oh, yeah. Because we all have like Mike Trout and Got Willie it. May. I mean, uh, Mike Trout and Mickey Mantle and uh, Sheffield. So it's hard to squeeze in Christian Yelich there with his fielding rating. But um, he's on everybody's bench because he his bat's just too good. And every time he pinch hits against me, he hits a home run. Every time, it's just unbelievable how good that card is. All right, two quick runs. All right, we gotta we gotta lock in hitting. Yeah, that makes sense though. I mean, I'm trying. I've been trying to get that Mike Trout, but haven't He's been able so to get it. So expensive, yet. man. Three hundred K. I'm like, dude. If yeah. I did pull him, I'd probably just sell him. Oh, honestly. absolutely. There's there's so many guys you can get for that price. I mean, like oh, multiple. Yeah. You get some of the best cards the whole in the game. Squad, honestly. Exactly. Whole new squad with this card. And the good thing is with um. With the face of the franchises and stuff, I know you're busy and like, I mean, you don't even have to be a pro, pro baseball player to be a little too busy to be doing like all those, all those uh, face of the franchises because those take some time. But um, oh man, um, but oh. what was I saying? Oh um, with how good face some of, of those franchise. cards are, yeah, some of those cards are so stacked that you really don't need to spend any money this year to have a stacked team. I felt like they did uh, pretty well with uh, like the I guess the amount of stubs that it costs for cards because last year I felt like a lot of cards were like in the twenty thousands, like yeah, thirty thousands. Yeah, there's um, there's like sometimes the markets just oh he was playing a perfect spot there. Um, sometimes yeah. like a few events happen throughout the year where the, it just causes the market to absolutely crash. Usually it's like a glitch or something or an exploit that people find and then it just ruins the whole market. But this year has been pretty uh pretty consistent with can we get there? There. There we go. Yeah, the pricing's been okay. Sometimes stub sales also like just make it die down. Because people wait till there's discounts on the stubs to buy all their players. Johnny Bench, how do you like this card? I actually like it a lot. I mean, I don't hit the best with him, but just having That's him behind the plate. Oh, he's yeah. a cannon. One oh, amazing D two, definitely. Uh, a like lot if of he hits, hit. if he hits like a few hits for me, like cool. Mm -hmm. Like I'm, I'm happy, but exactly. Like I feel like catcher is a position where it's just like, do what you do. Mm -hmm. A lot of the catchers that you'll usually have in this game or like guys like Gary Sanchez and stuff like that. And 
you're not used to having like that super good defensive catcher. Okay, we're gonna need one pair to not hit a three thousand foot. All right, there we go. Come on. All right, there we go. Do we need an inning like that? Come on, Josh. Can't make me look too bad now. Nah. Like I said, man, you're gonna. Do some, the... Somewhere in this game, my pitching is gonna <laughs> it's gonna blow up. Dude, the thing about All Star though, like I mean, last inning I was I was on every oh that was terrible. Like last inning on All Star, dude, you can oh. just punish the ball, and you're not guaranteed to get hits. I mean, it's like that on every difficulty. You know what I mean? But sometimes you need a little bit of a uh, you need a little bit of fortune to go your way too. Like you just cranked the ball, so it you didn't leave any you didn't leave any doubt there. I need to. I need to send him to the wall nope, like you did. Ball. Two balls, I uh, no I played three. Lucas Giolito the other day, and um, we he doesn't have a Diamond oh, Dynasty now. team, so we had to do use regular teams. So I used the Giants, and man, it was it was it was hey. painful. They they played my Giants, dude. I know we're not the That's best right. team ever, but every single guy on that team has like below a thirty speed. Oh, that's ugly. See, no, they're, I'm it. telling you, Josh. Yeah, the infield problems are there too, man. The yeah, infield right problems as are I there said, too. I've, yeah. I haven't had too many problems with uh, that first one. Dude, I lost that was my like a cherry hop to your boy too. That's what I'm saying, dude. It's routine. I literally lost a ranked seasons game right before me and you linked up because of a a ground ball to Didi that Did he go? Was supposed to be a double play and it ended up with bases loaded and one out. Yeah, and I ended up losing. You. It's just tough. That can't hurt you. Go oh, Carlos. Out of everybody in the MLB, who would you say is your best friend? My best friend? Yeah, out of, like your best buddy out of everybody in the MLB. Uh, that I mean, it's kind of hard. I got a lot of good friends. I would say Philly's one of my good friends. We've been uh, through the rankings since uh, Houston days. Who's that? Coming up. Brett Phillips. Oh, okay, okay. Love that guy, man. He's big uh, in the MLB community. Yeah, and MLB the show he, community for sure. He's uh he's a great time, man. He's just a great dude. And then uh, Adrian Hauser, that's my boy. I mean, there's so many guys that I'm pretty close with. That's a total... Yeah, it seems it's like a cool though. Like, go ahead. No, no, no go, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, that jumps uh, I was just saying it's cool though, like because like the more you're in uh, the big leagues and just go through uh, different teams, you start to meet new guys and new relationships with them and it's it's pretty cool oh, yeah. it's like you don't realize how small the community is until like you're really like kind of like there I yeah guess, if that makes sense no that makes sense i mean it's such a prestigious group of people you know what i mean like it seems like you think about all these clubs and how many people there are it seems huge but in reality you guys are a very small percentage of like the population that have like one crazy thing in common you know you guys are all at the very top of your profession. He's out. And I think this players league uh, that they did, it helped a little bit too. Just like getting to know new guys that you don't really get a chance to play mm -hmm. against or yeah, uh, kind of even play video games against. That makes sense. Were you, so were you big into MLB The Show before like this Players League stuff, or did this just kind of get you like into it? No, nah, yeah, me and my buddy played a lot. We used to play Diamond Dynasty. I wouldn't say I was the best. This mm -hmm. league actually helped me get better. But yeah. That's ball uh, me and my buddy Brian, we would just Two balls. basically Two stay up all night grinding, trying to get the best cards. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Oh, I mean, that's cool. It's not. Oh. It's definitely not new to us, mm -hmm. but... I'd say recently I've started to get more uh, into it, you know, getting more tips and figuring yeah. out how to be better. It's always cool when you, uh, like, when you play some of these guys and they, like, you find out that they're actually, because, like, the more I do this, the more, like, uh, normal it feels to do a video with one of you guys, because you guys, like, when you're somebody who hasn't, like, met guys like you or talked to guys like you, you guys don't feel like, it's it's hard to explain. You guys don't seem like normal dudes. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, they probably don't care about video games. They're doing all this stuff. 
And then you finally start conversating with some of these guys. Like, me and you were born in the same year. So it's like, why wouldn't you be, like, a guy who likes video games and does the stuff that I do? You know what I mean? And then once you start talking to them and stuff, it's like, damn, a lot of you guys are just, like, when you're not on the field, you guys are just normal dudes doing the same stuff that we're doing. Oh, yeah, definitely. Damn, I can't I mean, that's one of the things, like, dude, video games, I've played video games since shoot i can remember like when i was little mm -hmm. and i always loved um kind of like i got into gta a lot call of duty definitely mm -hmm. call of duty is my main game i never really could get into the the 2k games just yeah. because like i mean the animation of those games were never like well, that's legit the and then once sony came out uh or san diego studios came out with mlb the show man i was all over after that yeah no, I, oh, I he on that. Shit, it's about yeah, time. I, I need to get bro. some. I I just couldn't get I just couldn't get shut out, dude. I couldn't get shut Damn. out. I know you're a I pitcher. I know you're one of the best, but this is this is this is video games, man. We gotta we gotta show that you know, like I gotta show I could take control of this. Shit, you can't leave that fastball down the middle in any type real life or the game. Nah, no, that's that's very true. So if you were to if you were to like rate your your favorite moments, what was the best moment of like your career so far? I'd say one sixty three, man. Oh, one sixty three against the Cubs He's to out. put us into the clinch in the our central division, man. Dude, that that was a pretty cool thing because it was you and the Cubs, and it was uh, if I'm not mistaken, it was you and the Cubs and the Rockies and the Dodgers had to too, right? Yeah, was it was a two, Yeah, it was a two game uh tiebreaker. Dude, you want to know uh I mean, you may not want to hear this, but it's this is a part of my life is when you guys like Okay, I bet on you guys on that game against the Cubs, right? And then I won on you guys. Then I bet on you guys against the Rockies that next series, and then I bet against you guys. I mean, I I hate the Dodgers, but I just I thought that I thought that they were gonna do it, and I was scared because until that Justin Turner home run, it looked like it was done. You know what I mean? I thought you guys had full control of that, but I remember just being like, "There's no way you guys lose to the Rockies," and I thought that immediately after you guys beat the Cubs. Like I just I liked how that how that was kind of turning out, but I uh, I I forgot about that. Yeah, that was a good series. Seven games and it came mm. down to the wire. But I tell you what, that whole entire playoff just run was something that I'll never forget. But just the, the start of how we got there, yeah. I mean, it's definitely oh, something on. you can't really count us out on. Oh, no, absolutely not. Oh. That was insane. I remember uh, who went deep? Woodruff went deep, right? Woodruff went deep, yeah. What was that Kershaw. off of? Oh, yeah, it was off Kershaw. That's right. I um yeah, I was, was actually big. yeah I was on vacation at that time I was uh it was my cousin's camp? bachelor party and we were in Tahoe and I was just sweating that series the whole time I was out there <laughs> it was just like <laughs> I was just sweating it and uh yeah that was that was crazy that was just a fun series to watch now I gotta like on the contrary of that what was that feeling like after I mean because it felt like you guys were had the nationals done you know what I mean that had to have been like kind of a bummer you know yeah it definitely sucks man that's the thing it's like someone's got to win the game and sometimes you aren't the one that's always winning it mm -hmm. um but it was definitely it was a good i mean we had it all the way up until that uh eighth inning yeah and just that's an out. one after another blue pit mm -hmm. uh lose, losing control a little bit and just Dude. timely hitting man that's just that's the one thing that's nice is, I mean, it's baseball, so, mm -hmm. I mean, you just got to respect it. Sometimes you don't have it, sometimes you do. Exactly. And what's just, what's so crazy about that, though, is that, I mean, it's a it's a playoff game, you know what I mean? Like, that's, all the marbles are there, but it's just that one game, you know what I mean? The loser of that game goes home, and it's tough because, like, you could be the better team against that team, but if something like that happens, like it happened for them that's that's it you know what i mean they move on oh, yeah and i mean obviously i'm not trying to be that guy to be like think about what could have been but it's like let's let's say that doesn't happen and then you guys move on shoot that mean 
just that alone, there's a new World Series champion. Maybe you guys, maybe, you know what I mean? Maybe it's the Dodgers, whoever, but just a one thing like that, like, that's the beauty of baseball. It just can change everything. I got two one the count. Yep. Oh, man, that was crazy to watch. Yeah, you can never uh, I got to count, count anybody two. out, especially, no. I mean, if you think about it, I'm pretty sure the Nationals started off very badly oh, in their dude. season. And they were then, 19 and 31, I think. Yeah, and then they just turn around and, and oh. win the World Series. So, like, that's the thing. It's like, it doesn't matter what team you are or mm -hmm. how you start the season, man. It's like you play 162 games, things yep. can change and matter, so of, true. matter of a season. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. I mean, shoot, yep. even like as a Giants fan in, in 2016, one, no uh, in the first half of the season, we had the best re the best record in yep. the, uh, one, one. like we had the best record out of everybody in, in the whole first half. And, and then we two. just went and had the worst second half like one of the worst in MLB history. Nope. So it's right. like it shows you that it's just that full season. You mean, you know what I mean? Like you cannot put your four, you can't just down. get comfortable. It's, no, you can never get complacent with where you're at. I love. I just love how baseball goes with it. Like it's crazy how how long the season is, but it's. I think it's perfect how long it is. You know what I mean? A lot of people complain about it, but I feel like you you give these teams a chance to. To at least like battle against adversity. I mean, you got these NFL teams that are that are really good, but they get off to like an zero and four start, and it's you're almost like counting them out of playoffs already. Oh, Even yeah, if with, it's just crazy. Yeah, they definitely Ball don't three. have as much. Like if they go on a streak of losing, mm -hmm. shoot, no, even like chance. yeah, if if a key guy gets hurt too, you don't. Ball four. Okay, let's oh. go. You don't have a Let's chance go, to, bro. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. I gotta keep distracting you, dude. This is my only chance. I know. Right. Every time you talk to me, I'm I've been walking, guys. Homer. Oh. Come on, Carlos. This is my dude right here. He hits bombs. Oh my gosh! Don't do that. I got the count. Oh, and two. Um, what's happening? What's happening? It's hanging up. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> hey, hey. Perfect timing. Perfect Are timing. This, we just talked about this, bro. I'm telling you, fielding has gotten so that's embarrassing though. Just Bro, that was <laughs> that was in his glove. I need I need the people on YouTube to see this so they can we're replaying it just to show you how ridiculously flawed this game is. I mean Bro, like I'll take it like I get that out and you get a run. That's off his like... palm, dude. Come on, bro. The That's disrespect. off his glove. And I mean, like, can we be realistic? You play with this man every day. Should Christian Yelich be a, a common fielder in this game? Yeah, I mean, easily. I wouldn't say um, he has to have, like, crazy stats where he can, like, cover everything, but it's definitely, like, a routine play like that. Yeah, no, but I'm saying, like, shouldn't, like, like, do you, his, his attribute, he's, like, a 60 oh and that's what happens bro yeah An error to a bomb yeah that is what happens unfortunately but what I, no what i was saying is don't you think yellow should be a little higher rated than a 60 on defense oh yeah i mean dude that some of these ratings are just crazy to me yeah that but Dude, that's a prime example. Every time an error like that happens, you can be sure that something awful is going to happen right after. Oh, they, oh, yeah. It's it's Doing just out. a shame. I have no bar either. Yeah, that you gotta you gotta just mound visit as soon as that happens. I did. I still didn't come. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. That, <laughs> those are those suck. There you go. Let's let's see if we can. All right, there we go. Tiny. Here, I'm gonna warm I'm gonna warm you up too. I'm gonna warm you up. <laughs> we got it. We got it. That's for the Yeah. Hopefully I, it's, you give up a couple more bombs than I do. <laughs> no, nah, dude, we want you to look good. We want your we want Josh Hader to just give up no nope. runs the whole game. Well, I'm we trying to win this to game, so if you no, can, I know, I, I will... know. <laughs> Come on, Shohei. I love dude, it. I'm batting one seventy three with Shohei. That's disgusting. Nope, inside, ball two. I'm already tired, bro. Are you kidding me? Really? It says... Take two. 
Omer. No, oh, Shohei. Oh, oh. Shohei against lefties. You got to perfectly square that up. If you if you were to um, like if it came down to it, how many innings do you think you could go realistically and still have your good stuff? Because you used to start games, right? Yeah, I used to start. I mean, but it's a lot different once you go from relieving to mm -hmm. starting. Like, I mean, I could probably. I used to get three. I mean, obviously, when I was in middle relief, I'd go three three innings or so. Yeah, and it's definitely taxing, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Mm -hmm. The awesome thing about like drafting you and well, I'm in this like CBS league for fan. Ooh, nice rip. Is that gone? Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Low. That's was that JD? Yeah, yeah. It was JD, right? Yeah, he goes crazy, dude. He's yeah, he's, he's nasty. Uh, you know what? What better time? No, nah, the man right here. Let's go. Hang that slider, boy. <laughs> Ball, that's inside. Ah, go. Man. He's staying in for the rest of the game. But as, as I was saying, uh, in the CBS League, you get points for innings pitch with these relievers, and you get points for pretty much everything. But uh, saves and wins give you so many points. And then so, like, I mean, you get a lot of... It seems like you have a lot of uh, appearances where you'll come in, like, regardless, even if oh. the game's tied or whatever, and you'll pitch a couple innings. You know what I mean? A lot of, like, closers, it seems like that doesn't happen a lot. So you're... Definitely the main reliever everybody tries to get. Try to either like get a uh, find their way to get put into a situation where you'll get a win or a save. It's just a win win. You get as many points as starters most of the time. Inside. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, let's just Ooh. for sure just gonna go deep right now off of me. What's I your favorite? You tell me this fastball. Oh, you're out. Oh. Where, uh, what's yeah. your favorite ballpark to? To visit honestly man i like wrigley i like san diego san diego is probably my favorite mm -hmm. uh after obviously miller park mm -hmm. but uh san diego it's just like the vibes there oh you gotta be kidding me oh. <laughs> nope. He's good. no i i feel you on that and then wrigley's tight just because of the atmosphere that they bring mm -hmm. well, that's i would love to go there my girl really wants to go to Chicago, but everything that she wants to do over there, I don't want to do. And everything I would want to do, there's no way she would want to do. So it's kind of like a uh, Two balls, one strike. kind of bumping heads hey. on that one. Yeah, it's called, that's when you come down to the compromise, bro. <laughs> that's true. I'll happy go take life, pictures. At, life. Yeah, I'll go take pictures at the Bean if we just go, uh, let's go Wrigley one day. Yeah, that would be perfect. And then you go hit the... I don't know if it's called the Sears Tower anymore, but I think it is. It's gotta be. It's like the you know what I'm talking about, though. Yeah, it's the it's one of the tallest. Uh, ooh, you ripped that. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, yeah, dude. Hey, it's MLB the Show, man. That's just that's what happens. Oh shit! Forgot to warm somebody up. I do that every time. We got Carrie Wood. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Let's see what we can do. Taylor Trammell. Oh my God, his PCI is humongous. Oh my god, who is that? Oh, Miggy? What are you doing, Wood? <laughs> Dude, they just don't know. Cover the bag. Alright, let's go chip. Get some insurance runs. Ball the way one, you've been no hitting fight. the ball, I need them. Oof. Ooh. Damn. Damn, dude. <laughs> oh, dang. Just early, good. I'm I'm on these. It's just that you, you call that. It's that pitch speed, dude. It's that slight yeah, difference. That's the difference between me pulling a ball a million miles foul or just in a deep. Wow, oh, yeah. Carrie okay. Woods sold out on that one. What are we doing? There's a ball, bro. There we go. Sometimes I wonder about this game, dude. I wonder about it every game I play. I mean, in this game, this game, I'm the one who's benefited from it. That's the problem. It's like that's because I was telling you, not, it hasn't really happened to me before. Yeah, until... it's bad karma for you. One. You, yeah. the game was like, oh no, if if you don't know how bad we can be, I'll show you right now. <laughs> can never get too comfortable. 
Dude, I cannot stop hitting foul ball home runs. All right, I'm going to tell you what pitch you're throwing, and I'm going to hit it out. All right, you're going to tell me before yeah. I pitch it? Yeah, as soon as you go. Oh, so you're not going to tell me before so I can change it? Slayer. Oh, cutter. Yeah. Cut her up. <laughs> Another foul ball home run. There it is. I got yeah. You didn't call it that time. No, because I, I knew I didn't. I didn't feel like I knew at that time. Another foul ball, <laughs> dude. I just gotta. I gotta set a delay on my X, maybe. Oh, that's a homer. Yeah, that's there. It is. There we go. You hang it, they bang it. <laughs> dude, Kerry Wood, he's vulnerable for some hangers for sure. Got a boy Glaber. And this freaking home run banner that stays up too. They've done like 19 patches to try to fix it and it's still not fixed. Yeah, then you can't see what the count is or anything. Exactly. And it sucks for me for like I don't really care because I feel like I know the count, but when I'm doing these videos and I'm streaming and stuff, people just have no idea what's going on. And I'm too lazy to pause and get remove it, but now that I remember it's like all right, I got to do it for so people don't aren't left in the dark of what's happening. Nope, that's off the plate. Ball and two. please, Zach. <laughs> Good pitch. Out of uh, out of all the players in the league, who would you say? Well, I should say, out of all the hitters, which hitter are you most? Uh, I won't say scared to face against, but which ones do you know? Like, there's a chance that you're gonna get a give up a bomb. Uh, there... none of them. Oh, really? That's a good but answer. There is, there are like guys that are really good at bats. Like, I mean, because if I if I go up there thinking these guys are gonna hit bombs, then I'm gonna give up nope. a bomb. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, that's true. Counts one and I more meant like who has the best history against you. I guess that would be a better way to put it. Is that gone? Okay. Dude, that's a laser, man. Yeah. This is Pete, Pete I'm on ball. now, man. I would. Uh, I don't know. I mean, honestly, we'd have to we'd have to go up oh, on the Lord, Google and see. I mean, dude, that's that's how you know you've won two reliever of the years, though. It's just like, yeah, I don't know. It like there there aren't a lot. That's a, that's got to be a good feeling. That's out. I mean, I think if anybody that has hit some homers off me, I'd say Suarez from the Reds. Oh, really? He's, uh, yeah, he's. I mean. I don't know the splits on that, but I know for a fact he's got like two bombs nope. off me oh, on, I don't know, maybe like eight, eight at bats, maybe. Uh, he's nasty, bro. He's definitely eight. nasty. Dude, he Whoa. has no bar at all. <laughs> I mean, this he game, just gave up some tanks. <laughs> this game turned around <laughs> real quick, bro. Dude, I just needed that error, dude. That's that's the difference. That's After always that the error, difference. Bigger. We went downhill. <laughs> It's all good, dude. If you ever have free time, I'm always I'm always down to run it. All right. Especially with this quarantine stuff, it's a lot easier to get in games. It just, I mean, me and you have been trying to get in a game for a while, and out of all the quarantine throughout the time we've been trying to get this game in is when I've been the most busy for just no reason. Everything was popping up, but I'm glad we were able to get it in today. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's just tough with Ooh, like, trying to figure out workouts. And then throwing and trying to get back on the games. Exactly. Like you always think you have time, but then it comes down to it, and you don't yeah. have any. Like right now, where are you, where are you staying at right now? Uh, I'm I'm at home in Arizona. Okay. Do you have a uh? Oh, you have a house in Arizona, like specifically for spring training, or you've always had a house there? No, just where I live. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, do you, you have? I'm sure you have like a home gym and all that recently just got it because of all this stuff dude i've heard that it's hard to find that equipment yeah it right definitely now. was yeah like you had to get it way before everything was going down mm -hmm. the person i heard that from was uh nick Merckx. he was like he's been so bummed that he just cannot get any dumbbells or anything for his home gym oh yeah dumbbells are good luck yeah that's crazy what what, what do you have at the house Squat rack, cable machine, and then mm -hmm. we got some, uh, basically some medicine balls and kettlebells. 
I mean, dude, the the cable machine alone is huge to have. Oh, you can do yeah. so much with that. You basically can do everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dude. I don't I don't got big boy funds like that, so I just ordered this little like push up rack thing that you could just you can move the pegs certain spots to work out like your traps, your tries, and a bunch of different stuff. I'm I'm doing yeah. it the old fashioned way. Whoa. Hey, he whatever, just got like sucked works, in that bro. one. No, I mean, that's it. All I got to do is do that and go on runs and I'll <laughs> stay somewhat healthy. I mean, it doesn't help that I'm eating horrible foods every, well, not every day, but it's, let's just say I haven't been on a, on a diet. You're eating good, bro. Ain't nothing wrong <laughs> with that. <laughs> no, true, true, true. Okay. Okay. You got out of it. Oh, it won't end in a mercy. Moly, please. bro. We had a good inning though. Fourth and fifth just screwed me, <laughs> dude. It all comes down to the momentum. Let's say Yelich. Let's say Yelich just catches that. And then you know that's one run scored. Maybe you keep the same pitcher in. It's that butterfly effect, dude. The game screwed you. And when anybody asks, you just say you got fluked by me. Nah, <laughs> nah. Damn, oh, you're big on that, bro. Oh dude, shit, you got him. Out. No, the. <laughs> it's literally just a habit. I I always throw it to first because sometimes people do that. But your guy actually said he was going the second. <laughs> he said, "Damn, you're big on that." <laughs> that was the second time, and you almost got me out the first time. No, but uh, for some reason, your guys have just been oh, yeah. rounding. But oh yeah, they go. When you play online, like the balls like all the way at mm -hmm. left field. No, but when the oh, online, like, it's just, it becomes a habit. You just throw it to first just pretty. in case because, oh, good pitch, Ooh, Rom. That's pretty. <laughs> no, but we just throw it to first just in case because sometimes there'll be guys rounding or sometimes they just don't even run to first. The It's just being accustomed to how shitty the game can be sometimes. Hey, GG, brother. Yeah, GG, dude. It was a very good game. You were, you, you can hit. You were smacking the ball. It's just tough luck with some line outs, some hard ground outs and stuff, you know? But that, you had some terrible, that was we'll only a six back. inning game. Oh, we'll absolutely. Run it back for sure. Absolutely. But only in a six inning game, you had two horrible, horrible fielding animations. So you definitely can't be mad at yourself on that one. I don't think I can get mad at myself at this video game, man. <laughs> no, dude, you're you're doing it in real life. There's no reason to invest any any like like me, I get mad about it because it's how I get my money. You know what I mean? So I take it personal. For you, yeah, okay. it's like dude, it's just gotta be all fun. You know what I mean? But um real quick, just give a shout out to whatever you want uh people to follow you on, whether it be uh Instagram, your Twitch, whatever, go ahead and shout that out, let them know where to find you. Yeah, man. Uh, Twitch is J Hater Raid, and you can follow me on that. I'll be streaming probably Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. It's not like an official schedule, but mm -hmm. um, if you want to follow that, go check me out. Instagram is J Hater Seventeen, mm -hmm. and that's about it, man. Perfect. And I, I mean, for you guys that maybe don't know how to spell that, obviously, like always, I'll have all those links in the description below. So make sure you go show them some love for sure. And uh, yeah, man, I appreciate you even taking the time to do this with me. I know it can be busy sometimes, but it was definitely my pleasure. Absolutely, dude. Hey, I appreciate it again, and we'll, we'll definitely have to bring it back. Oh, of course. Of course. All right, so you guys heard the man. Go follow him and all that stuff. Show him some love. Josh, I will talk to you soon, man. I appreciate you. Absolutely, brother. Take it easy. All right, later, guys.